Johnson Isidun Kitiahu Pryo to the 10th National Delegates Conference of the National Democratic Congress, NDC, had been General Secretary for 17 years, emerged as the National Chairman of the party, beating incumbent Samuel Ofusuampofo. Sofo Audua Zoka was retained as the first Vice Chairman of the NDC, with Minister of Fisheries during President Mohammed Stenia, Dr. Sherry Aite, among the three vice chairpersons elected at Congress. Minister of Agriculture under Mohammed's regime, Franklin Fifi Fiavikwete, beat Dr. Peter Buama Otokuno and Elvis Ifriye Ankara to be elected the new General Secretary of the NDC. Former President John Dramani Mahama told party members and supporters the upcoming 2024 general elections will be the most critical elections with the highest stakes. A most critical election is due in 2024, and this executive is going to oversee that election. I believe that they understand the responsibility that has been thrust on their shoulders. He tasked the new executives to quickly get to work. We must cut the celebration short and set to work immediately. For those who were elected, we must be gracious in victory. And for those who have lost, let us understand that there's a lot of room under the umbrella for everybody. The former president lauded the work of the Electoral Commission as well as the Ghana Police Service towards a successful National Delegate Congress. Delivering his victory speech, new National Chairman of the NDC, Johnson, Isidun Kitia assured party members and supporters that the newly elected executives are willing to sacrifice their lives for electoral victory in the 2024 general elections. The 2024 elections is not only an election for the sake of the National Democratic Congress, but more importantly, it is an election to regain the independence of this country. And we are prepared to sacrifice everything, and I mean everything, including our lives, to make sure that this country is delivered. He called on party members to unite to secure victory in the 2024 general elections. We pledge on behalf of myself and on behalf of the newly elected executives, that in the coming days, our first assignment will be to work to unite the party and bring everybody who could not be endorsed today on board, even as we march forward to defeat the elephant and set the nation on the path of progress and prosperity again. Isia Dunkitia noted the friendship that exists between him and the defeated chairperson, Samuel Ufosuampofo, will not be taken for granted. The last hurdle for the NDC is to elect a flag bearer to complete the reorganization process ahead of the 2024 general elections.